What up, boys? It's by Reels. Update with staking and Blue Zell. We are now live on Frontier Wallet. Now it's going to be in the description. Frontier.xyz. It'll take you right to the App Store where you can get it for your Apple or your Android. Now, a little, I got my iPad set up here, ready to go. Uh, this is all very easy and simple to do. But uh, keep in mind, some people are having issues with the Android app and uh, converting or doing the inner chain transfer. And we'll get over that, but um, we'll, we'll we'll talk about that. But um, yeah, we're not we're not staking on a hot bit anymore. They reduced it from thirty percent to three percent or some crazy low number, and that just doesn't get us excited. Uh, but thank God, Frontiers now partnered with bluezell and they are live on the the hot uh the frontier xyz wallet for 20 percent apy or apr i think it's apr um and it's very simple so we have to do a few things now <clears throat> this is the app right this is our app and you can see i've got my blz wallet so there's a few things with this wallet it's a it's a um Frontier is based off the Cosmos SDK, so they're going to have a lot of different wallets that you can. Uh, the only ones we're worried about today are the Blue Zell wallet, the Ethereum wallet. So you have to start out with the Ethereum wallet here. All right, so Ethereum wallet, you'll see I've got, I've already, I've already staked my coins, right? Uh, but what you do is you'll go to receive here on your ETH wallet. So this address, you can send me your ETH. I'll, I'll gladly accept that. But uh, send your ETH to your wallet. And uh, I just put 20 bucks. I had $20 here. The gas fee to get this successfully done was about $6. So you, you add your ETH and you add your BLZ directly from Coinbase, Hotbit, whatever. The ERC20 version that you buy from an exchange. You send it to this address right here this ethereum address because it's an erc20 it's on the ethereum layer um, and it will automatically recognize it and it'll create a uh, it'll create a section here for your blue zell now you'll have your blue zell and your eth right on this wallet so I, I don't have any extra blz or anything to add at the moment but it would show up right here say uh however much ethereum you added and i have one cent of blz left if you put a hundred dollars of blz it'll be right here now what you want to do is swipe left select your, your blue zell wallet this will now be on the blue zell chain independently um now you can see here i have 486 dollars staked currently and what you want to do is an inner chain transfer now this screen right here is the one that's been bugged for some users on Android. So if you don't get this, um, you know, it sucks. You might want to try and update your, your phone. Um, or if you have an iPad like I did, I just had to use my iPad to get this to work. So here you would you will see two different uh, versions of the Blue Zell token. You have the ERC20 and you also have BNT. Since we don't have BNT yet, we want to switch to, want to be using our ERC20. Select ERC20. Now here it'll show, you know, your, uh, your ERC20 based BLZ token. And say here you had 100 BLZ, you would just add 100 BLZ, right? Boom. Here's where your Ethereum gas fee will come into play. This is why you need Ethereum. I selected average for mine. I really don't know if it makes a difference um, since we've been figuring this out with Frontier and Blue Zell on their Telegram and on their Discord channels. Um, they are adding these transactions manually. So uh, the that recent hacking that you've seen with like Axie Infinity, um, that's not happening here because the Blue Zell team is taking extra care and manually reviewing and accepting these transactions to make sure they're legitimate. And there's no funny business with that. So this is the exact reason why we are so bullish on BLZ is because of its interchain security. 
Now you would just select your gas fee, whatever you want, right? Then down here you would hit continue. Now since they are adding these manually, these transactions manually, it may take, it took mine over eight hours to be accepted. I think the team, they have certain times that they go through and they accept these transactions. Uh, so just be patient. Some people, it, it was an hour. I think it just depends on what time of day that you put in your transaction. I put mine in in the, the middle of the night, so I had to wait. I had to wait pretty much the, the whole day. Um, but once it is approved, we'll then see your BLZ and it's full amount and you had 100, 100 BLZ, it would show up literally right here, right where it says Blue Zell, right where I have a quantity of 0 0.009, right? So once you have your BLZ now on the BNT chain, it will go to stake and earn, right? And then we would go to Blue Zell, right on that top there, we select Blue Zell. Now you can look through these delegators, but literally none of them make sense except for the top one. Um, the others are, you know, like, why would you want to do research? Just, I mean, you really can do research, but I have no, no idea about these, uh, these validators. And if we're talking about private validators, I don't trust them with my BLZ. So we go with the one that's on, uh, based on frontier wallet, which is DM M4 high fees. It'll be the very first one. Select that. Select your amount that you want to add. So right now I have 0 0.01. For example, I would just type in 0 0.01. Right? Or you can hit set max. Obviously, I don't have enough to even pay the fee because I think the fee is like one blue Zell token from the BNT chain. It's a very low fee. Uh, but I staked about 3,000 currently. And if you want to look at your projected payout, right? So approximate rewards one day plus 1.6438 month plus 49, one year plus 600. Now, this here is how you stake passive is actually really good passively. And since we're racking these, uh, racking these up, at such a low value of 15 16 cents we're bouncing between right now this is extremely fucking bullish because we don't need to wait for kepler integration we can already be staking now and uh that means we'll just have more tokens the sooner we get we get staked now there is a 21 day or 28 day unstaking period um which is nothing new to staking you know do this and understand that it won't be liquid right away for 21 days um, but we're going to be holding well past 21 days on this token, at least for me personally. So yeah, fucking get your BLZ on here, get staking and fucking just start racking up those token counts. By the time this thing hits four USD, you'll be having a lot more blue Zell in your wallet than you did, uh, before you started staking. So yeah, tried to make this one quick and hopefully it was easy to understand. Hope y'all have a good night. Stake your fucking BLZ and let's get these fucking gains, dog.